So I'm Gail and we have travelled here today from Lincolnshire. When I'm not protesting, I'm actually a mum. Um, I have two teenage boys and I also run a business. I don't want to be here, I don't want to be protesting. I feel like I have no option. It's something that must be done and we cannot stop until we stop extracting fossil fuels. This is our fake oil art installation using plant-based fake oil. Uh, the rain will wash it away. We are here to protest against extraction of fossil fuels and we urge our government to act now in the face of a climate emergency. JP Morgan recently issued a report which acknowledges and in fact confirms what we already know that the human race will become extinct if we continue to commit the atrocities on our planet in the form of business as usual. So we urge our government to act now to tell the truth and to give power back to the people in the formation of citizens' assemblies so that we can look after our planet for ourselves. So this is Ash Wednesday. It's the uh, first of 40 days of actions um, across the UK um, as part of Lent. And today we are here with a theme around fossil fuel extraction. Air pollution is caused by fossil fuel extraction. Uh, it wrecks habitats, it wrecks homes and people's lives and we act here today in solidarity with all of those who protest, for example across Canada, against uh, oil pipeline installation and alongside our own Extinction Rebellion protesters who are protesting against coal mine expansion in the northeast of England. My name is Shell McDonough, I've come from London. I've recently just quit my job as a secondary maths teacher to now be an activist full-time for Extinction Rebellion. I've chosen personally to come down and support this action because I very much believe that the government is not acting now. Uh, fossil fuels are leading to uh, the extinction of the human race and are causing significant damage to the planet that we're already seeing. We're seeing this in our own country already with 25 people dying a day in London because of air pollution. The science is clear. They need to act now and divest away from any fossil fuels. We should not be using fossil fuels. They are killing people. It's going to happen soon. We will soon see our climate change significantly. We're already seeing a substantial amount of storms and flooding. This is only going to get worse. We must act now and I'm here today to make sure that the government gets the message that we must act now. My name is Alice. I've come from Lincolnshire. When I'm at home, I'm a mother of two teenage boys. I'm an artist and I'm a small business owner. And we've come down, we've brought our protest down to Parliament to make a stand against the government's inaction, against climate change and cutting carbon emissions, which the climate scientists have told us again and again we need to do. We need to act now to make a difference. With created a beautiful art installation on the most famous clock in Britain because time is running out and the fire extinguishers that we used to create the installation are symbolic because we need to put the fire out. Our house is on fire, we need to put the fire out and we need to act now.